Camarines Sur, Central Bicolano, Habagatan na Camarines, Filipino, Timig Camarines, is a province located in the Bicol region in Luzon of the Philippines. Its capital is Pili and the province borders Camarines Norte and Quezon to the northwest, and Albay to the south. To the east lies the island province of Catanduanas across the Makeda Channel. Camarines Sur is the largest among the six provinces in the Bicol region both by population and land area. Its territory includes two cities, Naga, the lone chartered city, as the province's religious, cultural, financial, commercial, industrial and business center, and Ariga, a component city, as the center of the Rinconada area and Rikonada language. Within the province lies Lake Buhi, where the smallest commercially harvested fish, the Sinarapan, Mystichthys luzonensis, can be found. The province is also home to the critically endangered Izarog AGTA language, one of the three critically endangered languages in the Philippines according to UNESCO. History Pre-Spanish and Spanish colonial time the earliest settlers in Camarines Sur are the Izarog AGTA people who live within the circumference of Mount Izarog and the Araya AGTA who live within the circumference of Mount Araya. They have been in the province for thousands of years and have been one of the first settlers in the entire Philippines. In July 1569, Luis Enriquez de Guzman, a member of the expedition led by Maestro de Campo Mateo de Saz and Captain Martin de Goiti, led a group which crossed from Burias and Ticao Islands and landed on a coastal settlement called Ibalan in what is now the province of Sorsogon. From this point another expedition was sent to explore the interior and founded the town of Camelig. In 1573, Spanish conquistador Juan de Salcedo penetrated the Bicol Peninsula from the north as made it as far south as Liban, establishing the settlement of Santiago de Liban. José María Peñaranda, the first governor of Albay and a military engineer, was made corregidor of the province on May 14, 1834. He constructed public buildings and built roads and bridges. The entire Bicol Peninsula was organized as one province with two divisions, Camarines in the northwest and Ibalan in the southeast. In 1636, the two partidos were separated. Known centuries ago as the Tierra de Camarines, the province is distinctly Spanish-founded settlement. Its name having been derived from Camaroncones or Camarines, a Spanish word for Camalig referring to small nipa or bamboo made huts by the natives. In 1574, Governor General Guido de Levesiris referred Camarines Sur to the King of Spain as Las Camarines, after the abundance of Camarines rice granaries, which were conspicuous features of the area. Spanish colonizers later subjugated its people and denominated the area into two distinct agrupations. The southern portion comprising the area south of the present town of Camalig, in Albay, Sorsogon, the islands of Masbate and Catanduanas, and the area, which is now Partido in present day, then called Partido de Ibalan. The northern, upper portion, which included from the present day Camalig town in Albay, and all towns of Camarines Sur and Camarines Norte, was called Partido de Camarines. Partido de Camarines was partitioned into Camarines Sur and Camarines Norte in 1829, and thereafter underwent fusion, annexations and repartitions until March 19, 1919 when two provinces, jointly called Ambos Camarines, were finally separated with their present boundaries by decree of the first Philippine legislature. The Philippine Revolution started in Ambos Camarines when Elias Angeles and Felix Plazo, Filipino corporals in the Spanish army, sided with revolutionists and fought the local Spanish forces on September 17, 1898. Governor Vicente Zaidan capitulated to the revolutionists on the following day. With the arrival of General Vicente Lucban, the revolutionary government in the Bicol region was established. American Colonial Era and World War II The American forces occupied the Bicol Peninsula in January 1900. In March of the same year, General John M. Bell was made the military governor of the southeastern Luzon. Civil government was finally established in Ambos Camarines in April 1901. 
During World War II, Camarines Sur came under Japanese occupation in late December 1941, following the capture of Naga City on December 18, a few days after the Japanese invasion of Legaspi. Guerrilla units were organized by Wenceslao Q. Vinzins that waged underground operations against the Japanese troops stationed in Camarines Sur. After the capture of Vinzins on July 8, 1942, the guerrilla movement was carried on by Lt. Francisco Boaz and by the tanking Vaca guerrilla unit organized by Elias Madrid, Juan Miranda and Leon Orias. In April 1945, Camarines Sur was finally liberated from the Japanese invaders against the combined Filipino and American troops in 1945. On March 8, 1942, the famous tanking Vaca guerrilla unit TVGU, was organized in San Nicolas, Canaman with Juan Miranda as the commanding officer, Leon Orias as the executive officer and Elias Madrid as the finance officer. Among the numerous Canamanons who joined up soon afterwards either in the unit's intelligence or combat components were Jose and Antonio Madrid, Mamerto Sabulo, Andres Fortaleza, Marcos Severo, Damaso Avenilla, Federico Crescini, Nicolas Vargas, Venancio Baguino, Eugenio Ragodin, Juan Pachica, Santiago Amaro, Jose Gervas, Pedro Angeles, Apriniano Lopez, Andres Altzate, Modesto Sanchez, Blas Alcantara, Andres Aguilar, Florencio Frondozo, Alfredo de la Torre and Flaviano Estrada. The military general headquarters and military camp bases of the Philippine Commonwealth Army were active on January 3, 1942 to June 30, 1946 and the Philippine Constabulary was active on October 28, 1944 to June 30, 1946 in the province of Camarines Sur. The Filipino soldiers of the Philippine Commonwealth Army and Philippine Constabulary were spearheading the local military special operations in Bicol region with the Bicolano guerrilla units decisively aiding them. In 1945, Filipino and American troops along with the Bicolano guerrillas, liberated Camarines Sur from the Japanese forces towards the end of World War II. Local Filipino troops of the 4th, 5th, 52nd, 53rd, 55th, 56th and 57th Infantry Division of the Philippine Commonwealth Army and the 5th Constabulary Regiment of the Philippine Constabulary were involved in the liberation efforts. Camarines Sur transfers its capital town. Naga City, the former capital of Camarines Sur, was founded in 1573 as Nueva Caceres, named after the province in Spain. It was among the original five royal cities of the colony. It was designated as the provincial capital by virtue of Philippine Legislative Act No. 2711 approved on March 10, 1917. In June 6, 1955 however, Pili, the adjoining town, was declared the provincial capital by virtue of Republic Act 1336. Pili functions as the provincial capital up to the present. Geography Camarines Sur covers a total area of 5,497.03 square kilometers, 2,122 square miles, occupying the central section of the Bicol region in Luzon. The province borders Camarines Norte and Quezon to the northwest, and Albay to the south. To the east lies the Makeda Channel. Terrain Camarines Sur occupies the central section of the Bicol Peninsula. With a land area of 5,266.8 square kilometers, 2,034 square miles, it is the largest province in the Bicol region. At the center of the province is the Bicol Plain, surrounded by mountains which include Mount Izarog and Mount Ariga. The eastern portion of the province lies on the mountainous Caramoan Peninsula, which faces the island of Catanduanas to the east. The Bicol River drains the central and southern parts of the province into the San Miguel Bay. Mount Asog is surrounded by three lakes, Buhi, Bado, and Baao. Climate The climate in Camarines Sur, like most of the rest of the country, is very tropical. It is dry from March to May and wet the rest of the year annual average rainfall is 2,565 mm 101 in. Camarines Sur has an average temperature of 27.0 degrees Celsius .6 degrees Fahrenheit, and a relative humidity of 25.8%, based from Era Tranquilo. Administrative divisions 
Camarine Sur comprises into two cities and 35 municipalities. Demographics the population of Camarine Sur in the 2015 census was 1,952,544 people, with a density of 360 inhabitants per square kilometer or 930 inhabitants per square mile. During the May 2010 census, there were 1,822,371 residents in Camarine Sur, making it the most populous in the region. The census also stated that Camarines Sur had 288,172 households with an average household size of 5.37 persons, significantly higher than the national average of 4.99. The annual growth rate was 1.86%, much lower than the national growth rate of 2.36%. This rate of growth will double the population of Camarines Sur in eight years. Religion the religion of the province is predominantly Roman Catholicism followed by 93% of the population. Other religions professed by the people include the Aglipayan Church, Iglesia Ni Cristo, Inc., Baptist, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, Mormons, Jehovah's Witnesses, Methodists and other smaller Christian groups. Islam is also present in the province with their mosques stood in large population areas. Prior to colonization, the region had a complex religious system which involved various deities. Among these deities include, Gugurang, the supreme god who dwells inside of Mount Mayan where he guards and protects the sacred fire in which Aswang, his brother was trying to steal. Whenever people disobey his orders, wishes and commit numerous sins, he would cause Mount Mayan to burst lava as a sign of warning for people to mend their crooked ways. Ancient Bicolanos had a rite performed for him called a tang, Aswang, the evil god who always tried to steal the sacred fire of Mount Mayan from his brother, Gugurang. Addressed sometimes as Aswang, he dwells mainly inside Mount Malinao. As an evil god, he would cause the people to suffer misfortunes and commit sins. Enemy of Gugurang and a friend of Bulan the god of the moon, Halia, the masked goddess of the moonlight and the arch enemy of Bakunawa and protector of Bulan. Her cult is composed primarily of women. There is also a ritual dance named after her as it is performed to be a countermeasure against Bakunawa, Bulan, the god of the pale moon. He is depicted as a pubescent boy with uncommon comeliness that made savage beast and the vicious mermaids, Majindara tame. He has deep affection towards Majindong, but plays with him by running away so that Majindong would never catch him. The reason for this is because he is shy to the man that he loves. If Majindong manages to catch Bulan, Halia always comes to free him from Majindong's grip, Majindong, the god of the sea and all its creatures. He has deep affection to the lunar god Bulan and pursues him despite never catching him. Due to this, the Baikalanos reasoned that it is to why the waves rise to reach the moon when seen from the distant horizon. Whenever he does catch up to Bulan, Halia comes to rescue Bulan and free him immediately. Okat, god of forest and hunting, and Bakunawa, a gigantic sea serpent deity who is often considered as the cause of eclipses, the devourer of the sun and the moon, and an adversary of Halia as Bakunawa's main aim is to swallow Bulan, who Halia swore to protect for all of eternity. Languages the main languages spoken in Camarines Sur are the coastal Bacol, especially central Bacol, and inland Bacol group of languages. The latter is a group of languages that includes Albay Bacol group and Rinconada Bacol, while the former just consists dialects. A dialect of coastal Bacol, called coastal Bacol Partido is used in the eastern portion of the province around Laganoy Gulf, and another dialect called coastal Bacol Central is spoken around Naga City. The Rinconada Bacol also known as Rikonada, under the umbrella of inland Bacol group of languages, is used by most people in the Rinconada area or district of the province especially in Nabua, Ariga City and by people of Rinconada in diaspora. Buanon, one of the languages of Albay Bacol group, another member of inland Bacol, is a minority language spoken in the town of Buhi and around Lake Buhi. Del Gallego is the only town in the province that has a majority of population that speaks Tagalog. Most inhabitants of Camarines Sur understand Filipino and English. The Kanaman dialect of Central Bacol variant of Coastal Bacol spoken in Kanaman, Camarines Sur is said to be the purest 
form of Bacol, according to Jesuit anthropologist Frank Lynch, S.J., though most linguists just consider it as the standard form of central Bacol language since other coastal Bacol languages, Rinconada Bacol and Buanan, both inland Bacol, are separate languages. Izarog AGTA language In 2010, UNESCO released its third world volume of endangered languages in the world, where three critically endangered languages were in the Philippines. One of these languages in the Izarog AGTA language which has an estimated speaker of five people in the year 2000. The language was classified as critically endangered, meaning the youngest speakers are grandparents and older, and they speak the language partially and infrequently and hardly pass the language to their children and grandchildren anymore. If the remaining 150 people do not pass their native language to the next generation of Izarog AGTA people, their indigenous language will be extinct within a period of one to two decades. The Izarog AGTA people live within the circumference of Mount Izarog, though only five of them still know their indigenous language. They are one of the original Negrito settlers in the entire Philippines. They belong to the AETA people classification, but have distinct language and belief systems unique to their own culture and heritage. Economy The economy of Camarines Sur is mostly agriculture-based, 29 of the 35 towns are agricultural and produce rice, corn, feed meal, freshwater fish, livestock, coconut, sugar, abaca, and water lily. Entrepreneurs engage in trading, often branching out towards neighboring provinces in the south as local demand might be limited by the third to fifth income class municipalities. Handicrafts are the major source of rural income, providing a fairly large share in the small-scale industries of the province. Forestry and papermaking are other sources of livelihood. The manufacture of abaca products such as manila hemp, hats, bags, mats, and slippers is one of the main sources of income in the rural areas. Fishing is also done along both shores of the province. Tourism, primarily because of Caramoan and Mount Izarog, also generates income for Camarines Sur. Naga and several towns have a tri-economy or three-base economy, commerce, industry, and agriculture. As the main center in the Bicol region, all of the products from other provinces in the region are brought to Naga. It has four major industries, the manufacture of jewelry and gifts, toys, housewares, and processing of pineapple and coconut. Naga also has vast cornfields, rice fields, and water lily farms all over the city. Calabanga, Cabaseo, Livmanan and Sipicot have similar economies to Naga City. Calabanga has commerce from goods moving out of Naga, and is the trade center for the towns of Tinambac, Goa, and Saruma. Calabanga also has fishing from the Quipeo Fishing Center, the largest in Bicol, and vast productions of corn, sugar, and rice, which benefit from a large granary. Libmanan has 156 hectares of rice fields and cornfields, and fishing along its coastline connecting the towns of Rigay and Pasacao. Libmanan also has a commercial district. Sipicot has an agricultural base economy, with an abundant stock of native chicken Sipicot's OTOP, and wide production of calamansi and other vegetables, while also serving as trading post for towns of Cabaseo, Rigay and Mercedes Camarines Norte. Fish products from these towns are received by Sipicot. Other towns not mentioned have a fishing industry as the main base of their economy. Tourist attractions 19th century churches, there are a number of century-old churches in Goa, San Jose and Sagni. Our Lady of Peñafrancha Church, completed in 1750, this two-century-old church is a site of pilgrimage located in Naga. Lake Buhi, created by volcanic activity, this isolated lake is famous for unique organisms including the world's smallest commercially harvested fish. Mount Izarog and Mount Asog, two potentially active volcanoes with hiking trails to explore rich biodiversity. Beaches of Sagni, Sabong, Partido, and Caramoan, these black and white sand beaches are shielded by coral reefs. Pasacao, known for its beaches as the summer capital of Cam, Sir. See also List of Bicol region cities and municipalities 
References External links Media related to Camarines Sur at Wikimedia Commons Camarines Sur Travel Guide from Wikivoyage Geographic data related to Camarines Sur at OpenStreetMap Official website of the Provincial Government of Camarines Sur